Hello, trading is closed on December 16th. Let's discuss today's stock market action. I said Saturday I would like to see a rally today, followed by a retracement under these lows. I also said I wasn't going to take that trade since uh, I didn't take the trade. I get no credit for the prediction. We took out a higher target of 1790.18 and there was resistance over it. We still have one higher failed target out there, 1793.59. It is more likely than usual not to print because the system likes to leave one or more failed targets at major changes in trend. We have a lower a target from today's trade because after this buy signal, MJT said this rally wouldn't stick. However, this, this price is very close to where we closed. Futures are already trading under its equivalent. And I think the real action, if we drop, will be in the low 1770s. If we are going to hit this higher price, I would think we have to have a gap over today's high. If we're going to hit these lower prices, in fact, if we're going to have any decline at all, I'd be pretty suspicious if we didn't have a gap under this low. And that's not part of the system. Let's take a look at some futures prices. This is kind of an interesting trade here. We had a 12 handle drop for no reason whatsoever. Futures traded to the equivalent of 1760 cash. That would have satisfied the outstanding MJT targets. However, the rules say targets have to be satisfied during regular trading hours, and that wasn't it. When you have a big sell-off on big volume like this, it tends to be panic selling and taking out everyone else's stop. A good rally is a sign it was a valid short-term low, but it's not so good when on huge volume we trade much higher at the open and then sell off the rest of the day. If we're going to get follow through at all, it should come right at tomorrow's open. So we have an interesting formation. Basically, it's not that good a formation. We have lower prices, but if we don't have a gap under this low, I would be suspicious that they might not print. We do have one higher price, and if we don't have a gap over this high, I'd be suspicious it might not print. And that's today's call.